Hey guys and girls, welcome back to Let's Play SMT2. Um, we're gonna head into this new battle mission, Being Human. Um, I think we're going to go see if we can rescue Psyduke. Uh, last time around, um, we powered up the Dragon Stream uh, powers for Yamato. Um, I want to apologize now because I had to cut out like a scene after that. I lost the footage. I it just it kind of got screwed up. It wasn't too important. It's just pretty much showing Yamato getting his dragon powers back to full it's power. To meet Miyako. Let's go. We have so to we're gonna go Daichi meet Miyako now and see what we can do. I know we can. Also, we have to save Daichi. Once I forgot that, that she kidnapped him. Save Saiduk too. Indeed, this is what we shall put an end to her plans. So, you came. Miss Miyako! Hmm. I see you brought Shijin as well. What came? Just for me. What's that? It's Denebola. Oh, she's got them all there. So this is where we're supposed to get sacrificed. Mr. Shijima, please hold still. <laughs> please don't kill me! I'm begging you! She untied him. I did too. Now then, I will only ask once more. Yeah, <coughs> bless you, bless me. Do you have any intention of cooperating with me? You heard her answer once. That should be sufficient. My solution saves the world with the least amount of pain and fewest amount of casualties. Why can't you understand this? No point in arguing any further. Whoever still stands at the end of this shall determine the fate of the world. Very well, Miyako Hotsuin. We shall obliterate this plan of yours. There shall be nothing left. Hell That's yeah. Right, Miss Miyako. We will fight against the path you have chosen with all our strength. Very well. I will have to force you to obey me then. Alright, come on. This is you, Yamato. Uh oh! <laughs> Clash of the Dragon Streams! They're evenly matched. Your powers will no longer work on us. I should have suspected you would find a way to neutralize my attacks. Of course we have. I sharp everyone. See that device holding Alcor? We gotta get to that and get it off. It's most likely being powered by the Dragon Stream. If I can reach it, I should be able to set him free. Do you really think I'll let you get any closer? Alcor is just as vital to my plan as all of you are. Agents, prepare for combat. Understood, Chief. Here we go. 
since I can now wield the power of the Dragon Stream, I should be able to operate the device holding Alcor. It won't be easy getting to him. It will likely take some time to set him free. Miyako's plans will crumble if he is released. I leave the command to you. Either we strike at Miyako directly, or strive to take back Alcor. Let's go. So I need him in the party at all times, right? We'll keep him in. Um, this party's good. We're good. See what we can skill crack off of these people. Coward, you are not prepared to sacrifice yourselves to save this world. Yet you think you have the determination to defeat me? Let us begin. I shall show you the divine order of the universe. You show us nothing. Miyako, crazy lady, teen, bean, jeans. Alright. Let's see, uh, what happens. I'm in position. I shall use the dragon stream to deactivate the device. You must prevent the opposition from interfering while I do so. Okay, so it's going to take time for him to do that. So, alright. So we just got to guard the steps. Don't let these people get up here and get us. It's useless. Even one who wields the Dragon Stream cannot deactivate the machine that easily. Agent, prioritize the target. Take him down. Come back to us, Alcor! Look who's up. You could say that. You're looking rather worse for wear, Alcor. Indeed, you are right. Thank you for coming to my aid. <laughs> Your thanks are unnecessary. Nice, Alcor. <laughs> and I didn't have to kill her. Or beat her, I mean, at the very least. I just ran around. Stand down. Ma'am? I said stand down, did I not? Yes, please. What is that? <laughs> Your spiritual presence has changed. It'll take more than that to disrupt my plan. Oh, what is she doing? I don't believe this. Now I see. Correct. Her other one, her true name, is poor Corona, one of the four corners of the sky, rivaling even the triangle. Oh, she she's an administrator, right? <laughs> So that is her true form. Miyako Hotsui, you are not human. What do you hope to accomplish by creating a new administrator? Uh, maybe she's a sword? My goal has they always mean? and only been to save mankind. I am Kor Karoli, yes. But I am also Miyako Hotsui, as a human. And as the head of the Hotsui family, I will protect humanity. Ah, oh, man. In order to do so, I shall see my plan fulfilled! No! Everyone, quickly! Summon your demons! Alcor's gonna fight with us? Oh, crap!
go. So you've already summoned your demons, no matter. Asterion. Watch out! Oh, he turned back into his form. His, uh, triangulum, not triangulum, septentrion form. Ooh. <sighs> I see. So a sword like you is immune to my magnetic field. Intriguing, but it will not save you. That power of yours, it not only interferes with the summoning app, but it strikes at the Shining One and his friends as well. I cannot allow that to continue, Miyako Hotsu. Your ideal idle threats are a waste of the little energy you have left, Alcor. You cannot defend against me forever. It is as you say, Kor Kuroi. I can't, I can't defend for too long. Yet I wager that my friends will defeat you before my strength has fled. Shining One, your potential is sh your strength. We can bring an end to this battle. Awesome. <laughs> All right. Cool. I got you, Alcor. We'll bring her down. All right. All right. We're gonna end, we're gonna end this fight. Hopefully. Managed to take down her arms. Ow. No, don't avenge. Dang it. Thank you, Dwayne. And it's done. Yeah, no, this is impossible. I cannot fall. No. No. We did it. We beat her. Uh, even with my powers as Kor Karoli, I still couldn't win. It seems as though I've lost. My plan ends here. Now, finish this. What? what You want us to kill you? Are you f***ing crazy? No! No way! We would never do that. <laughs> You're... Too soft. If you do not end this now, I may try again. I am determined. Devoted. I... I am not even human. There is no reason to hesitate any longer. Kill me and be done with it. I have failed as Miyako Hotsui, the shield of mankind. I deserve death. You deserve to live. <laughs> I've lost all purpose. There is no reason to exist as human anymore. But you... You tell me to live? Of course, Miss Miyako. You may have chosen a different path, but... You still wish to protect the people of our world. And without you, humanity would never have survived the Triangulum. So please... Don't say such horrible things. Don't say you want to die. But... Miyako, you want the same things as we do. You want to save mankind, right? If so, then you aren't our enemy. You're our friend. And we would never harm our friends. I am not human. I have fought you and failed. And you would call me friend? If you would have it so, of course. I mean, we're already friends with Psyduke. We're all <laughs> about the non-humans here. I know, right? Alcor is your friend? One of our best, Miss Miyako. You were willing to do anything to protect humankind. I suppose you're right. All I ever wanted was to keep humanity safe. That desire has always been my sole focus. Yet I... I cannot tell if this wish is truly mine alone. It may simply be how I was programmed to act. Perhaps my creator chose to make me this way. If that is so, I am nothing more than a tool, crafted to fulfill my creator's wishes. How can I say that I have a human side at all? What right could someone like me have to call you friends? <laughs>